following production is brought to you by Galactic North Productions. This audio drama is best enjoyed with headphones to appreciate the entire spectrum of the audio experience. Bill, let's take a look at this gum unit. Yeah, I'm seeing some serious damage here. That meteor storm really did a number on this thing. later.
We'll be on a transport call right before hanging time. And in less than a week, you'll be right back here with Papa Bear. Copy. I'll be there. All right then, little man. We'll see you soon. Liam out. <sighs> Who was that? It's... It's just work. They need me back at the palace. I gotta go. Ugh. When are you gonna be done with them? Doing fool's errands. Soon. I'll give you an update after I check in. Mm. Be safe. You too, Nash. I'll see you soon. Hey. Yeah? I love you. Killick. Killick, how nice to speak with you. Uh, it's about time. Talk to me, Zom. Please, it's Zom. I've taken care of my part. Tell me I'm getting off this rock today. I have just spoken with Lord Gorga. You have my word, Keely. Good. I'm on my way. Let Gorga know I want out of here before it goes down. Excellent. We'll be seeing you soon. <laughs> It's a steel, it's a deal, and it's got a great seal. You won't find a uh, killik hot enough for you today, you brute. Most nicely, most so have the synthetic body armor. It's a steel. Get out of the way. Move it. Get out of the way. <laughs> Get her nice and tied, boys. We don't want another is is the last time. Gorga will have our heads. <laughs> hey, what's the difference between a Wookiee and a Trandosh? Nothing. I killed them both. <laughs> you see that? Another one today. It's every week now. Yeah, I see it. Off to see Gorga then, huh? Another bounty? Someone else to throw in a noose or get burnt in with a blaster? Never deal with the hunts, Mr. Killick. Never! Take me to Gorga's palace? It's practically on the way there, Bolt Brain. Come on. What? No. No way you're getting the chance dice. Look, these are worth more to me than you and all your predecessors. I'll give you creds. Look. Here. Look, that's five, ten creds. I'm way overpaying. Let's go. That's more than you make in a day. You criffin' me? Who programmed you anyway? Don't get me wrong, you're not the best hustler I've seen for a droid. You're close, though. Ever heard of Han Solo? All right, just keep your sensors on the road. We're both from Karelia. Actually, we're pretty similar in a lot of ways. Apparently, he's got a pair of golden chance dice. It's just like these. I'll be seeing him hanging inside my ship one day. Yes, we will. So what? Your boss has got you doing deliveries for him? Whoa, 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 whoa. Keep going. Keep going. Jeez. Someone's got their wires to me. So you're working for yourself then, huh? Lucky you. Maybe someday I'll be able to see the same. Thanks. And best of luck.
Kirik Fast. So nice of you to come. Yeah, happy to be here. Hey, you sure you talked to Gorga about what I mentioned? I see them already setting up at the square. What's the holdup? When's my shuttle leaving out of here? Everything has been taken care of. Do you have any belongings you need to collect before your trip coreward? No. Wonderful. If you please, Gorga would like to have a word with you before you leave us. A word? Mm-hmm. Please, write this way. I, I really don't have time. I've got to get out of here before- It won't take long, I'm sure, Mr. Galik. <laughs> a simple congratulations. Any rim worlder would be honored. You wouldn't want to risk an affront to Lord Gorga, I'm sure. No. Of course. Lord Gorga will be pleased you've joined us. Your companions have been waiting. Killick, Hector, Aegeon, Zeb. Ready for our next mission? From Gorga himself. That's different. <clears throat> Something personal, perhaps. Could be better pay, at least. All crits wouldn't be too bad. Definitely. You guys see the hollows today? All Hector over here is starting segment. Oh yeah, raise the bounty. Fantastic. <laughs> Did you see it, Gillick? Yeah, it's everywhere. Hector the hero. Wait. Lord Gurk would like to tell you all a story. Doya Lisa, the Grancha. The world of Ulysia. There once reigned a great heart named Aruk who lived there. He had a most insatiable appetite for a certain kind of fare. <laughs> Can you guess what it was? Whatever it is you've got there. <laughs> Darkwa, Mr. Faz. Correct, Mr. Faz. It is the Nala Tree Frog. A most exotic delicacy. Lord Arok Mubit species. Na Lord Arok loved the species. In fact, he couldn't stop eating them. A priest by the name of Terowenza was close to Lord Arook and wanted him eliminated. And do you know what he did? He began to expose each case of frogs delivered to Arook with trace amounts of a certain poison until it brought it Arook's mind. Oh, and the last case of frogs was shipped without being exposed to the poison. Aruk died almost immediately of a brain hemorrhage. There is a simple lesson to be learned from this, my little friends. Do you know what it is? Gluttony. No butter. No! Trust. Your trust to those close to you can be deadly. <laughs> Atima. Now, mercenaries, you have performed admirably. I must thank you. But now the time has come for us to part ways. Me, into a bountiful future. For you, an unfortunate demise awaits. Zomo, you said... You have been found guilty of treason and conspiracy against the GIA and against Gorga. But what? These crimes will not go unpunished. Gorga, no trouble, Banda Pudu. Uba win Shulu, Pubadot. His Excellency commands you be brought to the town square, where you will be executed. 
Lord Gorga, your keeper and protector. You bounty on him now, do ya? Wait until it's big enough to fill your pockets with. Guards! Hey, hey! This is Tatooine! I'll hey. make this brief. The following stand before you. Hector Silberwolf of Planet Watwell. Aegean of Iridonia. Zeb Gabor of Malastar. Keelik Fars. Of Corelia. These four beings have been tried and found guilty of treason against the great Lord Gorga, as well as the Galactic Alliance. They have been sentenced to death by hanging. If any of you attempts to interfere, Lord Gorga has announced it to be his will that you will hang the following day. Remove their gags! If there is anything you'd wish to say, some farewell words, if it were, now is the time. Gorga, you criminal! Has anyone else anything to say? The Galactic Alliance is a spice house built on the bones of children. Today is a good day to die, you putrid slug. Long live the rebellion. Well said. I think that's enough. May any of you find yourself willing to die for the rebellion? Behold, the fate that awaits you, you brave souls. Do it. Stop her! I think so. What in the quiff does that mean? You think so? Shut up and move now. I'll meet you there. <laughs> what? No! Go! Hurry! Come on. <sighs> hey! <laughs> hmm. A vibroglave. Now this I like. Bill, can you hear me? Bill, I need you to meet me at the shipyard at the southwest side of town. Just now, go. Well, what do you mean you're busy? What are you doing? Are you, are 
you serious? Turn off the damn Molinette soaps and get your rusting taxi to the shipyard. Not in five minutes. Now. We're leaving. Just meet me there. This way. And you'll get it back later. Shipyards, do it. That's it. Come on, I'm driving. What? Anybody have a better option? We'll get it back. Troopers. Fantastic. We'll beat them there. Only half a click. So what's this about you not actually being a pilot? Never said that. And you are denying it either. What in the blinking bog happened back there? Gorga. Decided he wanted the bounty on Silverwolf's head. Guess he figured he couldn't trust us after that. <sighs> it's Barvey. The whole griffing thing. Coming up on it now! Get ready! There, that bird, the freighter. Go for it. Got it. Go, let's go! Kill it, Kira, front with Zeb. AGM, let's check weapon systems. Comms open, everyone. It's locked. Of course it's locked. Give me that. Bill, there you are. Help me with this door. Oh, don't ask me whose it is. Just do it. Now's not the time to start getting all goody two struts on me. Okay. Uh, Zeb, I need a status report on systems. Copy. I'm running it. Ship looked pretty good from the outside. It's been taken care of. Hopefully. Seen a few years, though. It has seen a few. Uh, let's see. System shows up light engines green. Deflector shields green. Repulsor lift thrusters. Uh, not green. How bad? Stabilizers, not green. Coaxium regulator, not green. Aegeon, I need to plot a course. Have you ever worked on a coaxium regulator? A what? Uh, forget it. Just strap in. We're gonna have to chance it. Hector, there's a light ion cannon on the ship's belly. I need you to head there and man it. Heading there. Kill it. You're going to pilot us out of here. I'm right beside you. Copy. Let's start her up. Okay. Accelerator. Stabilizer. Motivator. You seem to know this ship all right. It's Carillion. HWK-1000. I've sat in it enough times. <laughs> Dad used to work in the factory back home. Earliest memories were sitting in his lap right... Nash! Killing!
the shot. Mine. 
May I introduce Morph Drickle Lesserson? He's tasked me with eradicating these treacherous rebels from our galaxy. Morph, meet Gorga. A pleasure to finally meet you, Gorga. Your reputation precedes you. Morph, our friend Gorga here has just informed me that his attempt to eliminate the conspirators has failed. How disappointing. I've heard so much about the power and influence of the Huts. It appears those tales were greatly exaggerated. Gorga, Gorga, fear not, my slippery friend. I have a plan you will execute. To remedy this mistake, you will immediately place a bounty on the heads of the four traitors. Remember, Gorga, our alliance is a delicate balance, hard won over time. My forces are stationed throughout Mos Eisley. It would be most unfortunate if you were to feel unsafe in your own city. Twenty thousand each. Chipas Pesatima Putital Paches Pijana. General, you have another transmission. It's from a uh, Liam Hansa. Block all transmissions from him. It appears our friendship may be at its end after all. <laughs> 